Hey everyone, approximately we have a 2002 GMC Safari, Safari cargo van. And I'm uh, going to do a quick walk around just to show the overall condition. But this is going to be a great, uh, great work van for somebody. Uh, as you can see, it was used, looks like as like a carpet cleaning uh, upholstery. But you can pull those decals off, put your, your business name on there, and you're ready to go. Uh, it's got 262,000 miles on it. The tires uh, need, need alignment. So the front uh, tires are a little worn out on the inside. The AC isn't currently working and there's some uh, door handle uh, issues, but we'll go over that as we're walking the, the, the van. But as you can see, it's in pretty good shape. The paint uh, doesn't seem to be fading uh, or anything like that. It's still pretty shiny. Um, there's a few, you know, obviously some dents and dings here and there. Got some, some little, little dents down on the fender. Off. This is just vinyl, uh, vinyl lettering, so you can just heat that up, pull that off, and you're gonna have a nice, nice work van. But as you can see, the whole, the box itself or the van is, is pretty straight, and there's, uh, it looks like the paint is pretty good on the whole thing as well. So we're just gonna walk so you can see, see all that. And then uh, as we go down and look at the tires, you can see the tires are okay on the inside, but or the outside, but it's on the inside of the tire. The inside is where it's a little worn out. On the front, uh, that's where we found out that it needs an alignment because <clears throat> they're wearing uh, more on the inside than the outside. The backs, however, look pretty good. Uh, these are good tires on the back. And uh, looking around the back side of the van, you can see got a... Uh, Bumper's in pretty good shape. The actual doors themselves are in pretty good shape. Got a nice window tint. And uh, this this door, this back door only opens from the inside. So if you open that, you're gonna pull, pull the thing from the inside. Now you can see that the van pops right open. And you've got uh, you know all this space here to store things and, and drag things around town. So great for uh, any kind of car detailing business or carpet cleaning anything like that the van's totally stripped out in the back so you got plenty of room to work with there and uh, looking down the passenger side of the van uh, it's in pretty good shape as well it does have the uh, a pretty, pretty decent size uh, gouge on the on the bottom of the door there bottom of both doors which I believe causes this door not to open but the uh, the passenger door does open from the inside so you can open it that way access it uh, you know through the driver door and you can open for the passenger or you can go and open up the back as well but uh, looking at the tire here tires it's okay on the back the back tire should be all right uh, go ahead and look at the front here and the front tire is looks good on the on the outside but again you can feel on the inside of it uh, you know it's got it's a little bit more worn out on the inside than the outside so now we'll go ahead and check out the inside of the driver seat so the driver seat itself is you know uh, it's okay for a work van it's just a place to sit got some cuts and things the uh, passenger seat is in a little better condition uh, than that Look at the front, you can see there's no big cracks on the dash or anything, just needs a good good cleaning there. You can see it's 262,000 miles uh, on the van. Uh, it does show that it has that like emergency brake light. Uh, the emergency brake is off, uh, it just kind of must be stuck on some, somehow, um, but it doesn't actually, <coughs> the brake is not actually on. So now we're going to go ahead and lift the hood so you can hear it run. But the car, does, the van does run uh, and drive pretty good. It's got past the smog. Uh, it's ready for the road. So this can be a great work van for somebody to uh, get out there and go go get some things done. So this will go to the highest bidder on motobucks.com where you can download the app for Android or iTunes. Good luck, everyone.